You're the only answer to the darkness. You're the only right among the wrong. You're the only hope among the chaos. You were the voice that calls me on. And louder than every lie, my sword in every fight. The truth will chase away the night. Let's declare. Your name is power over darkness. Freedom for the captives. Mercy for the broken and the hopeless. Your name is faithful in the battle. Glory in the struggle. Mighty, you will let us stand or fail us. Your name is power. Your name
darkness, freedom for the captives, mercy for the broken and the hopeless. Your name is faithful in the battle, glory in the struggle, mighty you will let us down our fellows. Your name is power. Your name is power. Thank you, Lord, for the faithfulness of your promises and of your word that we can count on you in every season. Amen.
victorious forever and you are our God you are our heavenly father we thank you Lord for Jesus we thank you for the confidence that we can have to come boldly in your presence at any time because of the blood of Jesus we feel so thankful that we can do that that you've allowed us to do that together today even today, we will praise you. Even today, we will praise you. And when we don't have breath, we'll still be praising you, but for eternity. So we will praise you, even now. Hallelujah. We have a new song for you this morning. 
I hope some of you have listened to it this week, but just reminding us again of God's faithfulness, faithfulness to his word and his promises that the one that was, is, and is to come. No matter the season, he will not be shaken, he will not be moved. That is the God that we have, which is such a joy to us, such a reason to be thankful, such a reason to stand with confidence today. Because it's not about my strength, it's about the one that's unmovable, the one that is just, that is righteous, that is holy, that is loving and kind, the one that is the alpha and the omega, the beginning and the end. Amen. I encourage you to raise your hands where you are, to worship the Lord, to declare these words from your heart. Doesn't matter what age you are, you declare it with your heart. And God asks us to come with a true heart. Amen. God of Abraham, you're the God of covenant, faithful promises. Time and time again, you've proven. You do just what you say Though the storms may come And the winds may blow I'll remain steadfast And let my heart learn When you speak a word It will come to pass Great is your faithfulness to
of your greatness from one generation to the other. May we all speak to each other, Lord, of your greatness. The young, the youth, the older, Lord, that we would always, never ending and unceasingly declare the wonders of your great works, of what you are doing right now. Lord, help us to stand 
to not be silent, to not be put down and slumbered in these times, Lord. But let us be awakened and say, I will still bless you. In my generation, in each generation, we will stand as one together in you because you have never changed and you will never change. You are so faithful and we are so thankful, so thankful. We have you. Our faith is in you, Jesus, and you to lead us and guide us and speak to us, help us to listen, to obey, to be sober-minded and waiting for the will of our Father in the right now.